here we go with another movie that a lot of people didn't think I was gonna do and hey I didn't think I was gonna do it either myself but I just had like a influx of people asking me to do it on Instagram I also had a close friend of mine they wanted me to check this movie out as well and you know Jenna Ortega's in this movie and uh, I'm, I'm really into Jenna Ortega you know I love Jenna Ortega now you feel me like Jenna Ortega is the new it girl you know I used to be into Zendaya but you know Zendaya got her a man and everything now they talking about moving in together getting engaged like, like <laughs> <laughs> this is just a bull bro but yo what's up everybody welcome back to my channel my name is Melo. Yo, if you'd like to see my full-length reaction to this movie, any of the other movies I do, the TV shows I do, you can click the link down below in the description, man, to my Patreon. But let's go ahead and check out the fallout, everybody. Let's go. Dang, they bringing back the old school Warner Brothers logo? Okay. Right. And the intro? Damn, this movie is loud. I hope this isn't gonna be one of these type of movies, man, where I start crying and stuff, bro. Man, I ain't trying to hear your butt peeing, bro. Nah, her fine. Got that strong stream. That's gross. Yo, what is this intro, bro? This is gross. Bro, I don't know what's going on, bro. It's just like so much stuff happening back to back. Yo, the way that you spreading the peanut butter on that bread, bro, it brought up my anxiety, bro. See, this is goals right here. This is goals. This is gonna be me and Jenna Ortega in uh, a few years. Sorry, I didn't understand the words you just said. We need to come up with a code for I like that hair flip, bro. That hair flip, it usually works. I don't know what happened that time. I think it's probably your outfit. Nice. <laughs> you thinking about putting about? down? It's like... So you're just going to leave your window so down right for your car? Oh, and then when you... It could be like you're texting you, your boss. Texting your you're boss. Texting I love it. Boss. Yeah, that bro about to get robbed. Keep it fancy. That's what we do. <laughs> Does the kind of rock affect how long the aquifer lasts or how quickly it recharges? Oh, that's a great question. God, but that damn, depends fine, on many bro. factors. Well, hold on. How old was she when this movie... Came out. I'll just text it to you. Yeah, why didn't you do that then? I mean, I understand she's freaking out. This is her first time getting it. Jesus, Amelia, you don't text 911 when you get your period. Hey, you need to chill out. You're speaking too damn loud. Oh my God. Sorry. It's okay. Wait, haven't you been dying to get your period for like a year? I thought you'd be stoked. It's different than I thought. I love you. Congratulations. Don't say congrats, you freak. Why don't you teach her how to put it in i mean i don't think it's that it's i, don't, I mean i don't know i don't have <laughs> i don't know how how you put it in photo day better get my shit together girl you one of those type of girls you don't need to do shit and you still find this girl in school you feel me you really just gonna sit on the public toilet like that you ain't gonna put nothing down on the toilet i, just, I don't really like how they shoot in this scene and I, I don't like how like quiet it is, bro. Like there's a lot of dead air with them telling us that there's like gonna be some something going on with trauma, bro. I'm like really anticipating something. So my heart is like racing right now. Oh my God. What was that? What the? Was that a gun? No, 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 no. What type of shit is this? Yo, this boy really busting shots, bro. Chill out. Oh my God, this is beautiful acting right here, man. Oh my goodness. I really don't like how long that went on for. I'm not the shooter, it's Matt Corgan. I saw him. Oh snap, what the hell? Oh my God. Shot? My brother. Oh, 
Yo, I, I didn't sign up for this, bro. I, I didn't want to see this. <laughs> Yo, that sh had me speechless, had, had me shaking, bro. Um, yo, uh, it's not, bro. It's not expecting that. Uh, wow. I know the school shootings have been on rampant recently, so I can understand why they made something like this, man. That's, that's ridiculous, bro. I'm just, you know him? I, I'm happy she didn't get shot. I thought probably, you know, the whole cliche oh, thing was going to happen Amelia. where she got shot. Did you know anyone who died? Amelia. Let's do Don't tell me it was her friend. <laughs> Yo, they did a good job shooting that scene, bro, and just having that attention there and making you feel like you was actually there because it was like, bro, I, don't, I really don't know what's going on with me right now. Um, well, yeah, I feel like I'm about to throw up now. Man, like this should not be happening, bro, at all. You got these people that just hate their lives that want to take other people's lives. Like, what? what is that going to do? That's not going to make your life any better. Your life's still going to be sh You're probably going to end up in jail if you don't kill yourself in a cowardly way. Like, come on, bro. I like how they shooting this scene right here, man. Because, uh... I feel like a lot of the shots right here, and especially the way the cinematography is and with the blurriness and stuff, definitely gets you the sense of how they feeling. Yo, for the people who's been in like situations like this, man, how does this movie make you feel? Could y'all even finish watching it? How are you feeling? Better. That's good. So good. I'm really so glad to hear. I think she's just in that state where she really doesn't even know how to communicate how she's feeling. I literally thought it was a drill. Because Cambi had us locked in, shades are the window, in like two seconds. So I was like, okay, clearly this is this is a drill. Okay, cool. Right? He's not dead. Yeah, like, All right. Is, it's just so, it's so f I can't stop hearing the sound of it. Hell yeah, I feel you because the boy was over there spraying up. Dude shot like freaking 20 shots with the pistol and then brought out a freaking assault rifle. That I can do something to like make this never happen again. Mm. So I set up this Zoom with every town and we're going to talk about like how to be more reactive, how to start a movement, how to get a freaking bill passed, like something. And then the freaking government do stupid sh Oh snap, now you don't need proper documentation to get a gun and all this stuff. Like y'all 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 want this to happen. That's basically what they saying. They they do they want to make it easier. Special reports of a shooter, officers surrounded the campus directing the evacuation of hundreds of students from the scene. This crash. And I feel like the reason they doing this is because of population control. And I think they've been doing a lot of population control over the last couple of years, man. And I'm talking about with a whole bunch of stuff, not just with stuff like this. I love this. Wanna come in? Thank you. I think that's nice that she's wanting to connect with somebody who was in the situation with her. It's really nice. It's a cool vibe with the wood and the... You have a lot of cool art here, too. Yeah. yeah. Uh, my just, dad's Just letting me know I'm artist. poor. <laughs> Your parents are artists? Ah. <laughs> Yo, just my face, right? That's what I'm talking about that you're able to like just switch into a different mode. Like I could never do something like that. It's dope. She, what? <laughs> Little does everybody know she did that with Wednesday. Are you, are you sure? I have like a couple other No, things. it's- Yeah, yeah, it's cool, you know, shoot. And I mean like uh, I'm 17, you feel me? I just, I was looking to mess up my liver. You feel me? I'm sorry, I'm gonna oh. turn this off. My mom keeps checking in on me. I was really thinking about drinking for this reaction, but yeah, the fact that they're really I'm dealing with a serious this. topic, I think that probably would have been disrespectful. Can I ask you a question? Did you have like the craziest nightmares last night? Shoot, the way you chugging that wine right there, I thought you probably would have been knocked out, girl. Bro, I don't know what just happened, bro. I guess I was thinking about like how I would be in that situation, you know? Probably trying my best to keep it together, put that fake smile on, man. But I know I still would have been snot nose, choking up. You know, when you like cry and stuff and you have trouble breathing, you do that like, <laughs> you know, stuff, stuff like that. <laughs> man, now she having the shakes, bro. Her, her body's just straight twitching. Yo, what the hell? What is that? And when I'm asking like, what is that? I'm like genuinely asking, you know? I'm not like trying to make a joke or anything. <laughs> Never again. I only do that when I play my little dinosaur. <laughs> oh, hey, here goes the movie poster. Yeah. That's nice. I felt kind of bad for it. They're actually really good parents. Your pet 
backpacking for a trip. I don't like that she's holding it in because she's she doesn't want them to worry or whatever. Like, nah, man, you got to let that stuff out because you bottling that stuff in is going to make it a whole lot worse. But you got to communicate, man. Like when it comes to traumas and the things that you go through, I understand that you don't want to be seen as weak and vulnerable or you don't want to put a burden on some people. I, that right there, I don't understand. Like, come on, you're not a burden. Like, for real, like, please communicate, please. She's just been alone and I feel bad. So I no, feel no, no. I mean, it's fine. It's just like random. Is she okay? I mean, she will be. Are you okay? Yeah. The fallout brought to you by Applebee's. I saw Applebee's back there. But why is she freaking acting like this? Like me, if I was her friend, I'd be like, come on now. I, I can hear it in your voice. I understand not to pressure somebody, you know, but it's just like, come on, please talk to me. I, I, I can hear it. I can feel the energy through the phone. Open your mind, explain your thoughts, try to find some way to communicate, man. <laughs> so soon, it's been like two weeks. As long as you want to stay home, you know, your dad and I support that. Yeah, I was just about to say that, man. You gonna put her in therapy? Were you tired a lot before the incident? <laughs> Shane Lee Woodley, what? <laughs> what a freaky cameo. Or well, she isn't necessarily cameo if she's gonna be in multiple scenes, I think. I, mean, I guess that's what caffeine is for. Right? Ooh, I really like watching early seasons of the Kardashians. The OG Hidden Hill sh That is my vibe. That's crazy to see Shailene or Shailene playing the older person. Usually Shailene is like teenager and stuff. This is crazy, bro. Now I feel old. Are there things that you don't feel comfortable talking to your parents about that maybe you want to share with me? Yeah, my prediction. Okay. Come on, man. We, let's take this serious. I'm so sorry. Um, <laughs> when I get nervous, I make really inappropriate jokes. Yeah, I was about to say, I could already tell that was a defense mechanism. You got to stop lying to yourself. That's another thing I don't understand why people do that. But I understand a lot of people don't want to think that there's something wrong with them, that there's a problem with them. Like, don't think of it like that, man. What do most people come in here crying about their cheating husbands? Ada, I want to talk about you. I want to know how that shooting at your school has made you feel. Jenna Ortega is killing it, though, man. I never thought that she was this good of an actress, bro. She just, like, blew up, man. All you have to do is try and feel. That's it. No matter what those feelings are. And then you can bring it back next session. Or, you know, you can fax it to me. That's easier for you. Fax? What is this, 2004? <laughs> I don't know, turkey? Toasted? I don't care, Mom! Yeah, I don't know why you just turned up on your mom like that, man. <laughs> Yo, she killed that dance, man. I know I couldn't do something like that, bro. I would have bust my ass on that dresser right there. <laughs> Yo, and I know this is random right here, but for a lot of people who have been asking me to watch like Maze Runner and The Divergent, I'm going to definitely be watching those this year. I wanted to watch them last year, but uh, changed my schedule up. Sometimes that's all that needs to be said, man. You about time you brought the weed out, man. About damn time, man. That's all we needed. <laughs> Come on, man. Put that in the wine and we can drink. We can drink that. Edible wine sounds like a good idea. You get crossfaded? It's the shoulders. You ever got crossfaded like, no, you before? You can't do it without the shoulders. <laughs> I feel like that felt right. Definitely have to grind it way more. Damn, hurry up, bruh. Who'd have thought? Who'd have thought? I should have bought something that was already pre-rolled, man. Why do you trust me? Y'all don't really know what y'all doing. Because you smoked before? That looked too much. It's so thick. Oh, that looks awful. Is it ever too much? <laughs> we'll find out. I don't even know why I'm talking. I don't even know how to roll up. <laughs> oh, oh. So I love this shot right here. This girl over here looking like she's in her mid-30s. This is me. Girl, who, what the hell are you talking about? Usually it's the opposite for me. When I drink, I talk more. When I smoke, I shut up. We can't stay home forever. Why not? Sure, I just think that the longer you stay home, the harder it's gonna be for you to go back. You know, Amelia got her period. When? Forever ago. Guess she just didn't want you to know. I really don't want to know why she is being so hostile against her mother. I guess she doesn't like that her mother is pushing her out of her comfortability, you know, being in the house. Wait that I can do homeschooling as long as I want. Okay, I'm gonna try to get some sleep. Good night. Yeah. Even though I said, you know, switch her to homeschooling, it's good that she's going to school because, you know, you don't want to make things worse where then that's when it becomes like a crutch and uh, then that's when it will like mess with her mentally, you know? You got to get her back out in the world because right now she's uncomfortable being in the world and uh, the only way to make yourself better and make yourself stronger, you got to get comfortable in uncomfortable situations, man. 
Oh my god. There was two reasons to be scared right there. Oh, I forgot. Yeah, you you did have to pee. So damn, peed on yourself. Yeah, they saw that. But yeah, besides the PTSD of the gunshot, she also could have busted her ass, you know? It's good for you. Finish it. I just can't do arugula, Dad. It's the texture. Man, if you don't get your picky spoiled ass on to eat that damn food, who the hell you think you are? You ain't no damn celebrity. Just because you dancing on TikTok. Yep, that's ecstasy. <laughs> I've always uh, was thinking how uh, ecstasy would go. I was thinking, <laughs> thinking I might want to try it myself. <laughs> this girl going crazy like she listening to music right now. Cause this song right here is a bop. I knew it. Ugh. To know the difference, I'm not gonna help you on this one. You have a pop. That girl like, go to the restroom. You need to go to the hospital. Yo, Jenna Ortega need to be in uh, Euphoria, bro. Season three. Yo, yo. Shoot, they already saw her. They got cameras. Oh, that happened to me once too, but like it was a marker. Good story. What do you want? Nothing. I like when movies do this. They uh, show other actor in the mirror. Now why'd you do the drugs? Not with a Z. Dude, I literally don't know, so... Why are what you saying was, this on an open line, um, sir? So, is your boyfriend? What are you making? <laughs> Shoot, hey, uh, no, if it was me, bro, I'd be excited, man. I'm like, yo, I need to hit up the bar, bro. You feel me? General Ortega just asked me to come over, man. We got to go watch movies. Oh, my God, bro. Get my best cologne on, you feel me? You are going to stay in the living room, right? No, I was thinking we were going to snuggle in the dark in my room. Yes, mama. I was just asking. I mean, I, you know, I can still, you know, me. put the moves on her, you I'm know? Serious. She got the baggy clothes on, you know? I'd be like, hey, I'm a little cold. You feel me? Can we get some cover? You feel me? Honestly, I just can't believe that you're going to leave me alone to watch this cat float down the river all by myself. Oh, you're actually going to finish it? I have to. I have to see what happens. <laughs> okay, well. I hope everything's okay at home. You know how it is. Uh. <laughs> uh. I'm just just getting the vibe, man. I'm getting the vibe, bro. I know if it was me, I would have been like, oh, man, I wouldn't know what to do, bro. I wouldn't know. Go for a kiss on the cheek, bro. Maybe a kiss on the lips, you know? Ooh, I know. A kiss on the forehead, you feel me? Oh, my God, bro. But uh, it was nice to see him uh, have, like, a real cool conversation with somebody, you know, and they just talking. Like, we're bonded or something. Same. Now, what is it about her family that she doesn't feel comfortable with them, though? You haven't had sex? No. Do you mean you haven't had sex today? What? You dance like such a What? What the hell was that? I guess you think just because she got 80 plus thousand followers that she a uh, huh? I feel like high school sex is very 90s. Mm -hmm. And waiting until college is more now. Man, it don't matter, bro. Sex is sex, bro. Let me get in them guts, bro. <laughs> I may have gone too far in a few places. Really sweet. Or... When you go on tour with Drake one day. Oh my God. Just let him have it. <laughs> What's wheelchair Jimmy like in bed? I wonder what people was thinking when they was driving past them doing this. They like, what the hell is going on right here? Especially those people sitting at the bus stop. Yo, this movie soundtrack has had some bangers, bro. Beep. <laughs> God. Oh. Anything? Jenna Ortega is like really showing out in this movie, bro. Let's say this, let's say you die. Like her performance in this movie, it seems like she's not acting. Seems like I'm like actually watching a real life person, bro. Like everybody else seems like they're acting, except for her. Are y'all gonna kiss? Yeah, they're gonna kiss. Uh, see, now this is what I thought the movie was gonna be about. I didn't know that they were gonna deal with trauma with school shootings. Oh, damn, Jenna, oh, snap. Yo. Oh, snap, she grabbing the hair, yo. Yo. <laughs> oh my God, they, they did it. I thought maybe her and the black dude probably would have, you know, got with each other. She like, before I watched the movie, I had a feeling both of them were probably gonna have some type of uh, romantic thing going on. But then that's when watching the movie, I was like, all right, I think her and the black dude are gonna have something going on. Nick's been calling all morning wondering where you were. 
Look at her face, bro. If your phone was dead, we didn't know if something terrible had happened to you or... I'm sorry. The perfect child tells a fat one. No, no, no. This, I would have had her go in her room because she needed to shut her damn mouth. What were you doing last night? Thank Jesus. That girl was I, getting I it on. Someone. That's what she was doing. Oh, well, seeing someone. No. Mama. What are you doing? But you did, though. Last night, I slept over at my friend Mia's house and I got drunk. That girl got crossfaded. I really feel like the dad should have this conversation with her and not the mom because it's it have it hasn't really been working with the mother. For a month, I've given you space and 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 love. All I want to do is try my hardest to stop this from ever happening again. Like why why is that so hard for you to understand? Uh yeah, I don't really agree with that part. Like you were starting off good until you did that whole thing. Yeah yeah. Mhm. Mm Go be with Mia. It's gonna save the world with her hot. Thank you Nick. Wow. It, it can't be for nothing, you know? Tell me about your brother. I just want to know more about him. He was uh, real quiet. This dude in high school, he got an ST. Are you freaking kidding me? <laughs> this movie been doing a good job of uh, showing uh, what some people go through when it comes to like certain so traumas well. that they've been through. Now, now you about to get it on with him? You just got it on with Mia. Golly, girl. I'm sorry. I What's wrong? I'm just going through a lot right now. It's just I just don't know if I'm in the right headspace right now. I'm sorry. Oh my god. I am so sorry. No, you're okay. I know, of course you are. You're I'm so sorry. I like you. It's just like You freaking dumb What the hell are you doing? Are you freaking kidding me? You had Jenna Ortega on top of you and you like, oh no, nah, I'm sorry, bro. I'm not in the head. Are you I would have freaking grabbed her over here and held her so freaking tight, bro. Oh my god. Daddy, chill. Dude, you never say no to an opportunity. Are you freaking kidding me? We don't get opportunities like that. <laughs> I can't sleep. I really think this girl, uh, Jenna Ortega, is pretty much doing a lot of stuff to make her feel better instead of actually acknowledging what's going on. So when it comes to like doing drugs, you know, substance abuse, when it comes to, you know, sex, because a lot of people that go through traumas, they tend to do stuff like that, substance abuse or other type of stuff to try to block out the trauma and like the whole world and all that stuff and uh, just find like those moments where they just like, it feels good, but it doesn't last. The only person I can think of was you. Do you remember when I said that I love you, Dad? I thought I only had time to text one person, so I texted. <laughs> I didn't know that. You're my favorite person on earth, Billy. There's nothing else I can say about that scene other than that was a beautiful scene right there, man. Seems like now she's about to start that journey of healing. About time y'all interact with each other. I don't know what it is with movies and why they do this sometimes, but it's like they always have like the mom and the daughter have this like dynamic. And then like at the end of the movie, the father finally has an interaction with his daughter. Like why do they always wait to the end of the movie for the father to have the interaction? I understand like you could interpret it as a good meaning. Like the father is the one to kind of get to her, but you know, why wait so long? I can't feel anything. Good one. So I know somebody probably down there like, yeah, <laughs> you. Bro, what the hell? I'm that's what's up, man. Never distance yourself from the people that love you most. She, oh, she let you in, all right. <laughs> Yo. Yeah. This girl overdose. Oh, okay, okay. She just drunk out of her mind. Okay. Um, let's not ruin anything. Yo, at least I got a crazy story to probably not tell anybody. You could have it as an inside joke. I'm trying, I'm trying to be positive. It's amazing you told me shit. Yeah, you can't lock yourself in, man. You'll go crazy. I know you feel like you're probably helping yourself. It's, I'm telling you, it's gonna make things a whole lot worse. I'm gonna go with you. No, you're not. <laughs> we never discussed Stop trying this. trying to get rid of me. But you know, everybody goes through <laughs> Us their uh, pathway of trauma, their pathway of grief differently, man. And you got to let them go through it. There's nothing wrong with being there for somebody and being their support and helping them. Like, they're doing so much amazing stuff. And for some reason, I feel like I'm unable to do that. I feel like it has kind of ended our friendship. Yeah, fine. Yeah, fine. Sucks. Just, you know, talk to each other again. I really, really miss them. 
Uh, but I mean, you know, it's probably even not even your purpose or responsibility to try to do something to change the world. I mean, if you want to get involved, get involved. If you don't want to, then don't. You know, there's nothing wrong with that. Don't blame yourself for not doing something. Everybody's different. I feel mad because I had no idea one guy with a gun could fuck up my life so hard in six minutes. And then I think I should be grateful to be alive. Those six minutes probably felt like an eternity. I mean, they did. They did. That scene was crazy. Why I made it and other people didn't. Um, but then when you sit back and you think about it, you realize, no, there isn't any reason. None of us should have died. I'm having a really hard time moving on. I wonder if there's a lot of other people that probably feel the same way too, you know? So many people lost their lives and then, you know, you you didn't and you just probably feel like it's unfair or something. I, it's, it's so messed up, man. Oh, I'm gonna try to be more honest with you about my life. I'm telling you all of this because I want you to know that I'm I'm never gonna do any of that stuff ever again. You know, the, the bad, the bad stuff. <laughs> Oh, uh, wow. Uh, okay. Well, thank you for uh, for trusting me with this information. Soon now your mother's about to have nightmares. She ain't gonna be able to sleep. Was that too much? No. Hell yeah, get the wine out. I'm processing. <clears throat> <clears throat> yep, that's what I'm saying. Get the wine out. Stuff was with a girl. <laughs> it's not like I'm gonna get pregnant. That's a bonus, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Girl, you better dr pour that whole bottle up in there. I'm, I'm ready to talk about it more now. But I can tell why she's uncomfortable at her house. They ain't got no blinds. Just let people just look all up in your house and stuff. Get the windows open. This shit needs to stop, bro. Like, for real. It really needs to stop. I guess seeing that was like motivation for her. I know she's probably about to have an anxiety attack right now, but I'm talking about in the future. Well, uh, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to sleep tonight. Dang it. Um, wow, that was the fallout, everybody. Um, I hope y'all enjoyed my reaction and watching the movie with me, man. You know, if you like, you can like the video and subscribe and comment down below your thoughts. Um, y'all can also follow me on my social medias. I know, like, we, this, I know this stuff happens so much now that sometimes you probably feel like you, might be numb to the whole thing you might be desensitized to it but it's like once you actually feel like you're in the environment it it just it, it changes man and um uh, just like people don't have people do not need to lose their lives man over some bullshit, bro because somebody hate their life or somebody feel like some stuff is just unfair whatever i don't believe the whole mental illness thing i think that that's just a whole little excuse i don't believe that shit whatsoever i understand there's probably gonna be some people that disagree with me on that i'm sorry i don't i don't believe that shit, bro i feel like now it's at a point where there's people doing just to do it now and it's just like why choose to do that like all right everybody and there we go with the fallout i had to take a little bit of a break man and just get myself together i'm still like not all the way there i just i feel like this movie did a really good job of having you feel what the main character was going through and communication is key man with any and everything like if you don't communicate it just makes things a whole lot harder i understand that just something inside of you something inside your mind and just you don't really feel right interacting with certain people and just talking about certain stuff but bro you gotta talk about it man you can't hold it in bro it makes things a whole lot worse i understand that you know you probably feel like you're being pressured but it's just to them they don't really know what else to talk about to them all they're worried about is you and what you're going through you know what they can do to make you happy what they can do to make you feel better that's why i feel like that might be a reason why some people will probably look to people outside of their main circle because you know having somebody that doesn't really know you like that and doesn't really know exactly what you've been through you know you could just like talk to them and just talk about certain stuff where you could get your mind off of what you actually went through 
and you kind of feel like that's helping, but that's basically like you running away from the problem and that's you trying to cover up the problem. You know, yeah, it feels good in the moment, but later on down the line, bro, that's not gonna help, man. General Ortega was amazing, bro. Like, gave the best performance out of everybody. I love the soundtrack. I love the directing in this movie. I was going through a lot of emotions watching this movie because I, I really felt like I was there as well. I can't wait to hear your thoughts when it comes to this movie, man. Also, I wanna make this like a safe space. So, you know, if you have anything going on, bro, like, feel free to put that down in the comments, man. One of the things that I was kind of scared of watching this movie, I, I didn't know if they were going to go that route or not, but it's just something in my body was like really thinking that she was going to like end herself. And I didn't want that to happen. I know you probably feel alone. I know you probably feel like you're not important. I know you probably feel like nobody cares about you. Nobody understands, but you just, you got to communicate, bro. And uh, believe me, there are a lot of people that feel like you are important to them and that actually care about you and love you and they just want you to be happy bro i will actually go ahead and give this movie an a minus man it was just fantastic and uh if you would like to see my full length reaction to this movie any other movies i do the tv shows i do you can click the link down below in the description to my patreon and uh with all that being said i'll see y'all on the next one all right peace mm -hmm.